Hello all, my name is Pablo to Hunter Reaction. Guys, today we are going to react to another theme of Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth 3. I'm really surprised with the last theme I react, the Divine Beast Dancing Lion. Really amazing style, so also different, and as I say, these themes are so like intense, so dark, and so chaotic. I don't know, really want to play the game, guys, I really want to play it. But for now, we are going to listen more themes about this game, because as I can see, it's a DLC, it's not a new game. So this here comes like a new uh, kind of music, so I'm really excited guys. Today we're gonna react to a team called The Promised Consort, also for um, uh, this DLC. It's quite a popular uh, team and also it's a recommendation of you guys. So I don't know what to expect guys, I'm used to these teams be so dark, so intense and chaotic. I'm expecting like the same of this team, but I don't know guys, that's the magic of the game. So I hope you like the reaction, let's go. Okay, so far no so intense. I like that. Okay, so far it's more calm compared to what I was expecting. It's more like an introduction, you know? Okay, okay. So far I like it. It's full of contrast, you know. I was gonna say at the beginning that doesn't feel like a boss team, but after this part, it's probably a boss team. And also I see in the comment I read is for someone or something called Radan. So probably it's a boss team. No way that chorus is so perfect. Also it's like a little bit heroical, you know? That's highs and lows, you know? I really like it so far. If it's a boss team, it's really epic. Probably is an important boss because things so definitive, you know. Okay, I think it's a second phase coming. Okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. A really drastic transition, like to the strong to the soft, with a really beautiful chorus. It reminds me like a lot of the rings, like the Rimendal team, you know? With that beautiful chorus. And also like an introduction, you know? It's like the light fighting the darkness, you know, because we can sense both parts, the light with the voices and the darkness with like the backgrounds. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. We have this beautiful voice with some like drums, percussion, a really a violin, and also like some like short bells, you know. It's a really beautiful team. It's more calm compared to the ones that react from this game, but also have like his, his house essence. No way, it's so beautiful. Is so beautiful. I think so far this is one of my favorite themes of Elden Ring. No way, that violin in the background with like the church bells, really like that. And also the box is so perfect. No way, this team is a masterpiece. No way. Really wasn't expecting this at all. At the first, I was expecting a team more like intense, like the last one I react, because I only have time like to like to understand it. But this team is so different. It's a really beautiful team. That's it. It's already over. But at first it was really calm and I was expecting like more intensity, but then I, at first everything was like introduction, maybe to the game or maybe like to some like cutscene, you know? But after that it turns to like something really different and for the comments I was reading like here in the video, they mentioned a lot someone called uh, Radan, so probably it's like a boss team. General Radam, okay, I need like more context, you know, to understand it, but for the comments I'm reading this like is a boss team and probably a really hard one. But I don't know guys, I'm really surprised with this uh, team and with this music, as I said before, this team feels like poetry, you know, because it starts low, then like goes high with intensity, then goes down with that beautiful violin, the chorus, the girl's voice. I really feel like Lord of the Rings like uh, memories, you know, like entering to Rivendell, the elves like a uh, kingdom, you know. Like introduction, really, really the same. Then again, to the intensity with the percussion, with like it's a really com complex team. It's something I really like about this game, and most of this team, because the last teams I react to Elden Ring are so beautiful. They are so like I don't know, like so everything at the same time, you know. So it's really difficult to understand it at my first like try, you know. And this team, I think so far I understand it without like uh, hearing it again for a second time, because for the last team, the Divine Beast Dancing Lion. I need to hear like three or four times to understand this meaning of the like the elements because I think they use like wind, uh, thunder, fire, a lot of elements. But so far I understand uh, quite well the meaning of this team. But I don't know, guys. You can leave in the comments what you thoughts about like this uh, team, and also you can recommend me more music because this uh, DLC is quite recent. So I think there's a lot of music to react. So I wanna be really happy to continue bring you uh, like this uh, content to the channel. And also, why not maybe music of the other original game, because I only react like to three or four teams of Elden Ring, the original one. So, I don't know guys, you can leave all that down in the comments, and as you know guys, really thank you for being here, thank you for all the recommendations and support to the channel, it's been amazing, we are almost at 2000 subscribers, really thank you for all the support guys, I really appreciate it. So, I don't know, I hope you like the reaction, if you like the reaction, leave a like, leave a comment down below, Welcome more music, can be more Elden Ring, uh, more video games, anime, you know it guys. And thank you for being here, I say bye-bye.